Hey, I trust everybody had a safe, happy new year. Looking forward to this new year coming up. We definitely had a good year uh, this past year. I've uh, been on vacation since Christmas and I got tired of sitting around. I actually got sick right before I started my vacation. So uh, I got tired of sitting around and I looked around my wife's reclaimed uh, wood area here and saw what wasn't really going out the door. And I wanted to make something out of it so people can see that it might look like trash, but it's definitely somebody's treasures. I went ahead and put a bridge together. Y'all uh, take a look at it, and I definitely thank the subscribers that subscribed to me this year. And if you haven't, please subscribe. Hit the bell up in the top corner, and you'll be notified of our next project. Got some really big seawalls coming up. And like and share. If you got any comments of anything I've done, please uh, leave me a comment, and I'll see if I can't get back to you. Thanks. So you might ask what I do when I go on vacation. <laughs> I ask to keep building Saw a bunch of wood left laying around over in the reclaim center over there that's just been kind of sitting there. So I said, I bet you I can make something out of it. And I've made that pretty heavy duty bridge right here. Pretty cool. I've got a 20,000 pound tractor that we put on it, drove across it, doing just fine. Every single thing you see on this bridge has been reclaimed. The deck boards are double two by 12 bands that have come off of boathouses. We've cut them up and uh, used them as my decking. All the pilings are old pilings that we've salvaged off of jobs and I got them driven in and notched in and put in place. Here's the pilings we set. They're 10 foot long. They're eight and 10 inch diameter pilings. I put a board on either side of it to kind of use as a guide for my chainsaw whenever I'm uh, cutting the poles so I can get them cut nice and level on the top so that the top cross member can sit flat on, on it. put on now is some big old poles. stringers put in place and I gotta get them notched down so they're all up. A little lower halfway done on the bridge now. Getting ready to set another bent, some uh, stringers, and then deck it out. If you're coming out the night, Rick, you can take these last couple two by twelves and cut them down to fit right there and that's about it you can probably do it with tractor lights perfect nice fit last 15 foot section going in right now then we'll have the bridge completed well here's a good testament to the strength of the bridge got a uh, 325 g john deere skid steer 20,000 pound 308 cat traco and probably another 13,000 pound 35 g john deere traco all sitting on a bridge at the same time All right, we're wrapping up the bridge now. It'll end up being 55 foot overall. Give me access to the other side of my property over here. It's a real beautiful, heavily wooded area with some uh, giant live oaks. I got a forest stream over here now. Doing a little bit of clearing for us. This is going to be a beautiful area.
big nature area. Once again, I want to wish everybody a happy new year and y'all stay safe.